Pierce Volterra is replacing our older Pierce apparatus uh, here at our headquarters station, uh, Fire Station 1, serving as Engine 1. And Station 1 is centered in the downtown core of the city. And Engine 1 typically goes on 4,300 calls a year uh, on that particular apparatus and about 12,000 calls a year for the firehouse. So they do see it share of fires and uh, technical rescues and emergency response. So we've been a longtime Pierce customer for around 20 years, and it started with one of our chief officers uh, who wanted to make sure we had the safest, most uh, up-to-date, most technologically advanced fire apparatus on the market. Right now, with the city of Portland and all the climate action plans and the environmental uh, requirements that uh, we're up against, we want to make sure that we're doing our part as the uh, fire bureau to uh, have an apparatus that can reduce uh, the carbon emissions and uh, make the environment a, a healthier place for us. You know, there's a lot of information and data when it comes to the cost of carbon emissions, when it comes to exposure to carcinogens, when it comes to exposure to diesel exhaust and particulates. And so I think just from a global standpoint, as well as a national and local, it really is, what is our responsibility in the fire service as an industry? Uh, there's enough hazards that people have to expose themselves when it comes to the fire ground that we can't control. But when it comes to coming in and out of the station, driving down the road, getting to and from an incident, as well as backing into a station, that's our job uh, to keep them as safe as possible. So the, the primary goal is firefighter safety and health. And we, have, as every department around the nation and around the world understands, uh, we have taken a, a huge toll when it comes to firefighters exposed to occupational hazards that we have the ability to eliminate. Pierce has been awesome uh, from day one. Uh, they've been very supportive, uh, going back to the legacy apparatus, to the Volterra apparatus. They've been very supportive, always answered our needs, and always researched uh, questions that we had uh, problems or questions uh, to. Uh, through the health of wellness, reduce carbon emissions, and uh, also the carcinogens uh, that are produced by diesel particulates, and uh, also be responsive to the environmental needs of the city of Portland. Uh, but by the time we put it in service, our firefighters have to be comfortable. Uh, and again, it's about trust to ensure that this vehicle or this apparatus is going to be dependable. We wanted an apparatus that's going to be dependable, uh, provide the power that we need to get up to the hills of the West Hills in Portland, and also be able to pump at uh, high-rise fires as needed. It looks and feels the same as a typical fire apparatus, and that's what the firefighters really wanted. Uh, they wanted the same hose configurations, they wanted to have the same water gallonage, and they wanted the same fire pump capacity. So, coupled with the battery operation, electrified, uh, made this a, a home run for us. Uh, we had the Pierce representatives that helped us out with the charging station infrastructure. Uh, once we had that in place, uh, we just made sure we had policies in place at the firehouse, making sure the operators understood the pump systems, the uh, operation of the ap actual apparatus, and uh, just minor tweaks in, in in-house policies. And so there's so many thresholds and check marks along the way, and this was a two-year process. So we feel pretty good as far as having this as a frontline rig uh, that not only the firefighters can work off and depend on, but the community we serve uh, also can um, know that we'll be responsive and always there. What is important is that firefighters are able to work off these rigs and be able to, you know, have, have the manufacturer collect the data in order to refine and improve uh, performance and technology. When you look at where we are in history and you look at us as an industry, who wants to be on the forefront in a partnership where you're working together to design the fire apparatus for the future?